Hello guys, in this video I will show you the best uh, route, in my opinion, to mine minerals in uh, Genshin Impact because as you know, uh, minerals are really important for uh, in this game. With the minerals you can craft uh, items and the most important is uh, you can craft uh, weapon level up material, so weapons uh, uh, EXP, those ores. The, um, so normally I just pick up the white iron and the crystal that one because the XP amount is really low so I just pick up those two and uh, because uh, all weapons just need those two type of our ores uh, minerals so uh, after some tests uh, I mm, found uh, that pet in my opinion is the best and uh, some spots are not uh, must do for example here you can see I pointed it as 8.5 because it's, if you want to do a faster route you can just skip that point within 15 minutes maximum maximum 20 minutes in uh, uh, you will be able to collect most of the minerals in uh, in the game for now uh, maybe here because there are many of the crystal but uh, they are one far away from the another one so it's not recommended to loot here unless you have time to do that but if you just want a fast route you can skip those and just go there for the spawn because it's near near to the teleport waypoint just the same as other places just like here you can find many of all crystals in those spots but they are far away one from each other there so it's not recommended i those points are good because in every of those points there are many of ores together so let's start from the first one we teleported here the first point is here so three two one let's go in my opinion the best char uh, character to mine miners is uh, Razor because uh, Razor just needed to use one E skill and he can collect everything you can see there are many of those ores just a place in the center E and collect everything here, here, this one. Okay. After that one, just uh, teleport uh, here. Okay, from there. More accepted. Collect everything you can collect uh, during the path, uh, so yeah, because they are useful. Okay, yeah. same again. E. I don't care about the chest now. Okay, another one here. Nice. Now, after that, uh, uh, there is another point, but you need to go across the lake. White iron, normal iron, white iron. Okay, after that, the fourth point is uh, here to the domain. Just to go here. Okay. There is a hole, just to go inside the hole. And you will see four of the crystal. There is a chest. Okay, there are some uh, slimes. I killed those slimes uh, before because uh, they were annoying. So yeah, I just uh, killed them. And uh, okay, after we collected those, uh, if you want you can break that wall as well. But I don't want to do that because those enemies are annoying. If they see me, they start to shoot me with uh, the bow. Now after that, uh, teleport on that point. Go immediately here. There is a normal ore. If you want, you can get it. Uh, other two crystals. No, what the fuck? I didn't charge it the entire skill. Anyway, after those two go behind you. There is another really good uh, position for uh, many ores. Many of them, the white uh, iron. After that, teleport to the 6.5 this is optional because there are only two ores uh, so yeah if you want to skip you can skip but if you want to get you can get because it's really near to the spawn you can see it's just here okay after that uh, let's teleport on the seven point it's on the cliff so you need to jump down okay spawn go on that direction you can see there are some white ores this one, now teleport back. Go in that direction, don't care about enemies, just uh, ignore them. 
can see here, there are many of uh, white ores. Now, uh, yeah, the other point is the optional one. So if you want, you can go take. If you don't want, you can skip it. Also here, if you want, uh, yeah, when you jump down, there are two white ore or irons. Okay. And uh, there is a crystal. After that, uh, teleport to the ninth point in the stor Storm Terror layer. Okay, it's uh, just the right, uh, right here. There are two of them. Okay, after that, uh, this is the 9 point, right? The 10 is the, fir uh, the first uh, teleport waypoint uh, in Li Yuan. This is optional as well, but uh, yeah, since it's uh, really, really near to the spawn point, uh, I advise you to get it. There are two of uh, iron, white iron. After that, uh, the 11 point is here. So just uh, teleport uh, in that position. Now, go back on that. There is a hole. Uh, there's not many crystal, but there are other type of uh, minerals, so it's good to take them because some characters uh, will need them. Also, those flowers uh, uh, take them because yeah, they are good. Okay, teleport away. So the 12 point is here. There are many, many of uh, crystals, so this is a really good uh, mineral point. After the after you spawn uh, the teleport, uh, climb that uh, mountain. Okay, there are two of the crystal. I didn't uh, I didn't uh, put a icon here because uh, yeah, it's just uh, near to the main uh, mineral point, so it's really easy to remember that uh, place. Ignore those enemies because yeah, I don't want to fight now. <laughs> Okay, after that, uh, uh, this is uh, the 12. The, ter uh, the 13 is here. There is a 12.5, so it's optional, but I recommend to go there because there are three of the white iron. There is one. There is another one. There is another one. So after that, just teleport back again. And this is another really, really good uh, main uh, mineral site. All you need to do is just uh, jump uh, from there. Oh, there are also two of uh, white iron. So if you want, you can also collect them. Okay, jump down again. As you can see, this is a really good place. Take those fruits as well, because yeah, why not? Don't care about the enemy. If you find the enemy annoying, just kill him, oh my god. Okay, uh, I collected everything, right? Yes. So this point is finished. Uh, this was the 13. Now we can go on the 14. This point, there are no crystal or white iron, but uh, uh, this is for the um, amber. Some characters uh, need them. But if you don't need, just skip. Also, uh, beside that uh, point with the four umbers, uh, near to the uh, mountain, there are other points with the umber. But uh, yeah, they are far away from uh, them, one from each other, so only if you have time. Now, teleport here and uh, fly down. Also, I really like to pick uh, Ningguan uh, in uh, the squad because he can, she can tell me where the miners are sometimes. Uh, so if I miss something, to be honest, I have time to mine all the map. To be honest, so yeah, she's really good. As you can see, there are four of the crystal. This one as well. Okay, after that uh, we can go. This was the 15. So let's go on the 16. In that zone, there are nothing special because it's one here, one here, one here. So it's not recommended to do to go farm in that zone. Now the 60 point is here. Just to go down. There is a ruin, so you need to go inside that hole. You can see. 
There are some enemies if you come here for the first time or when the enemy respawn, but uh, just to kill them. And you will find the many of the crystal. Okay, there is another one. And there we go. After that, the 16 point, uh, let's go on the 17, start off with the 7 here. Okay, turn back. Run on this way. If you want, uh, just to collect uh, those uh, eggs as well, because yeah, you can keep cook uh, eggs. Uh, those items uh, as well. There are other e eggs. Uh, just to pick them, uh, why not? And uh, he here we go. There are some uh, enemies, I already killed them because they were annoying with the bow. Just to go down, don't care about the slimes. And now, go back, I mean go out from that uh, ruin because there are there is another site you can see here. There is a ruin uh, guard. Uh, but uh, just ignore. Okay, I got everything, yes. So this was the 18. Now the 19 is here. Teleport on that uh, teleport waypoint. Fly here, you can see there are um, pretty good amount of crystal. Also, there is a mine uh, see sight uh, but uh, there are no crystal only white iron and normal iron so if you have time you can go check here as well okay there we go okay so the 19 is done this is the 20 teleport here there is another cave so this way don't worry if you can't see when you are on the top because you need to enter from there there is a abyssal hunter, but uh, I already killed him. So maybe if you come here for the first time, you you have to kill uh, the abyssal hunter. I mean the abyssal uh, caster. There are other two of the crystal. Okay. Uh, there is another Amber, so if you need, just a take. Now the 21 is that position. Uh, here there is a Beastle Hunter, uh, Caster again. I didn't kill, so because, yeah, I just didn't kill. Okay. No, not him. Okay, shut up, uh, you are annoying. After that, let's go on the uh, 22, so on that position. Teleport, turn back, and go. Uh, I did only one mark, but there are actually two sites uh, near from them. The first one is here. Okay. Other one. And on their point is here, you can see, he's hided. There are three crystals. Oh my god, so unlucky. Why only one? Normally it's uh, between one and the two, and rarely is uh, it, it can even drop a three of them. Now, if you want, really want, there is another small site, uh, but there are no crystal, but only other type of ores. So if you want, you can come here to collect them. Okay, after that, uh, that was the 12, 22. We can go on the 23, on the, that position, just teleport to here. On that island, there are many of the ores, uh, and uh, on the road, you can also find the others. Just to go here. You can see there are some uh, crystal just to collect. The island is that. Get the crab to, yeah. The best uh, addition requires crab. 
So just to collect the crab. There is another one. Okay, right up. Right up. Okay, you can see there is another crystal. There are there are also two crystals, so skill. Finally two of them. Uh, one uh, Another one, there are some uh, of those items, collect. And now swim to that uh, small island. Hello. And uh, this is the normal route. Uh, if you can sell those uh, sites I told you is not necessary, for example here. Uh, or the point uh, point uh, five. Uh, is, uh, this is the best route to do for to get those uh, crystals uh, and uh, white iron. Now I will show you other two sites uh, for um, for some uh, extra white iron if you have time to explore there. So let's teleport to here on the domain, on that direction to the mine because if you remember this island uh, has a um, uh, small. Uh, Ghost town, and uh, before that the town died, it was a mine site. So let's go here. There are some uh, enemies. Uh, just ignore, as always. No. You can see there are many of those uh, white iron. Ah, just to die! Oh my god! And uh, there we go. Now the other site is here, pretty far away from the from any spawn point. You need to swim uh, to there, but it's pretty good uh, place for some uh, white iron. It's on that island. Okay. Swim. I already have a maximum of the stamina I can have for now, so I can swim to there. If you can't, you can go there and uh, swim to here, so the distance uh, is uh, lower. Now, go down. You can see there are some enemies, but there are many of ours as well. Okay, everyone dead, right? Yeah. You can see there are some white ore. Okay. Okay. So if you take the crystal and the white iron only pet, it will take you only around 10 or 15 minutes. But if you want to get other ores as well, then it's between 15 and 20 minutes. Now I'll show you the two map. This one is for only crystal, so only if you want to get the crystal and the white iron and you don't care about other ores, you can follow this one. But if you want to follow those, all those sites I showed you in the video, then you can follow this one, this map. And this is only the faster route, so if you want, uh, the Storm Terror layer is really good for crystals. They are just uh, far away from each other, so it's hard to collect them. But if you have patience and the time, you can collect more than 100 per, per run. Also, crystals have uh, 3 days to regenerate, uh, while the White Iron is a uh, no, white iron is three day as well, or two, I don't remember. So, it's recommended to make uh, one of that run every three days. And if you have a friend, just invite your friend to make a um, co-op run. Because if uh, you mining with your friend, uh, the drop will be double. Not, uh, not double in that sense you can collect double, but in the sense you can collect, but your friend can collect as well. So both can get one of that mineral when you mine a mineral. And when, if, if the party is uh, built by four members, then the drop will be four. So everyone can get one mineral. And when you're finishing your world, you can go in your friend world, then in the friend two world, then in the friend three world. So if you have a patience at the time, and the dedication to farm, to, to mine, then, uh, yeah, is uh, you can get more than 1,000 per day with, within some hours of mining. But that will become mm, boring, so just do that uh, once uh, every three days is enough to make weapon XP, to make um, weapons, so it's really enough. 
and uh, I don't recommend you to just uh, go in a stranger's world uh, and uh, just uh, join and uh, start to mine uh, randomly. Don't do that because the people hate that. They will kick you and you will probably enter in their blacklist. So if you really want to mine with the strangers, just go in the world and talk to him friendly. Hey, do you want to mine together? Or maybe, hey, do you need the help in some bosses? I can help you and then let me mine something. So just do that. And never just go here and mine without permission. So thanks for watching guys. Hope this video helped you. And see you in the next one. Bye bye.